Welcome to the Chris and Tina Johnson Project. I just wanted to greet everybody and this is going to be a unusual episode because we're just going to go to the laundromat and we're just going to see how does the laundromat work. video on how to use the laundromat. It's about that time of the year and it's getting colder and the blankets are smelly. <laughs> Some of the blankets are really big and we really need to get them rewashed. So what do we do? We go to a industrial washer or a laundromat and we get them washed. Yay! So welcome. And watch how how to use the washer at the laundromat. <laughs> Please hit the like and subscribe button. It keeps our channel going. So the very first thing that we need with the laundromat is quarters. And I had to break the bank, literally, to get in of quarters. <laughs> and then we had to drive down to town to a laundromat. It was early enough, it was like about, I don't know, four or five o'clock, but you know, it's winter, so it gets dark sooner. And there is the coin laundry. Isn't that awesome? Max coin laundry. Laundry parking only. Well, that's good. And we're just going to go right in with our laundry. And it's just a blanket and yeah, basically empty can't see the people I really like using these industrial size ones so this one is like three dollars I can do that let's put our down syndrome I mean <laughs> down bl blanket I hope this didn't offend anybody everything in there anybody. no it doesn't fit I guess I need a bigger one all right how much does this one cost see that grime how do you close this thing there you go oh oh okay put it down okay five dollars I don't even know if I have that much let's see if it counts down all right at least it counts down for me I don't have to count for it that's a good thing Okay, so the open hatch there tells us where to put everything. Detergent, bleach, and whatnot. There you go. Detergent goes right in there. And just make sure that you get a lot of it in there. Just so the blanket is nice and clean. And ah, that looks really good. All right, so we're gonna close that hatch. And oh, it's spinning. It's so hypnotizing. It's already like bubbling and cleaning. So I guess 20 more minutes and then we're done. Still no people. <laughs> but some of the dryers are running. It's kind of odd though. Ah, <laughs> oh, the hypnotizing washing machine. Whoa. Okay, 22 minutes. So 22 minutes is the whole cycle. And guess it's done let's see are, are you sure it's done let's see oh yeah it's wet it smells good all right so let me get my bag and we'll drive home yeah I have a dryer at home so I didn't like use the laundromat for the dryer because I ran out of quarters <laughs> no but we have a dryer big enough to dry it so Chris is gonna help me with that I'm sure it's not that far. Now it's dark. It gets darker faster in the winter. So at home, I found Chris and he wanted to show us how to dry it. We didn't need the public dryer. So we like great value. It smells so Whoa. good. <laughs> what is that? It's a dryer. So one, two. And what are those? This is fabric softener to make it nice and soft and smell good. 
three. We're gonna do four. He carefully takes out the blanket from the bag. What do you think? It smells good. Just put it in there as good as you can in the dryer. All right, and then you shut it. Turn this on. What's that for? This is all the lint. You want to clean this out before you start it. Why? So it'll pull all the lint off of it. And we save that for the fireplace. Mm. It burns really good. What's that you pressed? Star. Chris didn't end there. He showed us how to clean it. We hope that whoever needed to find out how to use a laundromat found this helpful and if not, maybe entertaining, but in any case, thank you for watching. Chris and Tina Johnson Project. Please hit the like and subscribe button. It keeps our channel going. Thank you for watching the Chris and Tina Johnson Project. Your time watching is what keeps our, our channel going.